Okay, now it's time to get ready. You just come with me. I'm gonna start with my <laughs> primer. I already put my moisturizer serum on for today. This is my favorite thing lately. It's called Glow Daily. It's by Ren. It's got vitamin C in it. I just love it. Mia loves it too. It smells really good. And then I've been using this No Pore Blem Primer by Touch and Soul. And I actually found out about this on Itsy. I, Ipsy. um, Ipsy, sorry. I'm just gonna put that on as a base. I always feel like it makes it to where things don't go in my pores and keeps my pores clean. Hold my makeup a little longer because it kind of has a, I don't know, like a little bit of a powdery feel to it. And I have quite a few foundations, but all my, this one's getting low. I found this on Ipsy too by Tarte. <laughs> this too on Ipsy. I'm telling you, Ipsy, I should be a spokesperson for Ipsy. This one I actually got on Ipsy too. This is more of a foundation. This is a moisturizer. This is a foundation. So what I like to do is I don't like a really thick foundation because I kind of like when my freckles come through, especially like halfway through the day when my foundation wears off a bit, but the rest of my makeup's still there. That's when I like it the best. So like I just did like a little squirt of this and a little bit of this. And I just been using my hands. I don't, I haven't been using a beauty blender. I do it at home sometimes but everything's different in an RV you have less stuff at home I have like this huge makeup desk I have like drawers down it I have a mirror with lights I don't know I just feel like in the RV all I have is this bag of stuff a little basket and my mirror it's really a lot different I'm not complaining though I've actually enjoyed the simplicity I'm gonna tell you all about this stuff because I found out about this from a friend. This stuff is amazing. It's called Lumify. It's a little pricey. Like the very small bottle is like $12. The bigger bottle is like 20. And I just do this like, I mean, maybe, maybe once or twice a week. Just whenever I want to like feel extra like cute because it makes my eyes so white and then my eye color really pops. There is nothing like it on the market. It's my favorite. So it's called Lumify. And I guess there's something in it that's prescription grade. She was recommended by a um, pharmacist. She had went in and be like, what can I get to, to kind of get rid of these, these red eyes? And she, they said, try this, it's amazing. So she tried it and she loves it. And that's what she uses. Oh, this is my this is my blush. It's not at all real pink. It's more of a mauvey nude color. Anyways, I like it because it's creamy and it's not too pink. I'm just I think this time of year I just like to have something very subtle, very natural, don't go crazy kind of look. And you know, I'm feeling crazy today. I'm doing a liquid eyeliner. I never do a liquid eyeliner, but I am today. Neva asked if I was gonna do a wing. I think maybe I'll attempt a little baby one. I am not a huge wing girl. I think because, you know, when you're when you're in your late twenties like I am, I just I feel like maybe I'm too outgrown the wig that, or I'm just not capable of doing it because my age, I don't know. That can't be it because I know women all over are doing this and have absolutely no problem. It's just me. Okay, this is my very subtle attempt of the wing. I don't know if you can see that very well, but it will all be blended when I'm done. Okay, here's my attempt on a wing. But I'm going to blend it in and make it look a lot better here in just a second by taking my powder. I have these really cute powders 
these I use just about every day. I do have some other stuff, but this is my favorite. I'm making James wait just a second so I can finish my eye makeup. Because driving and doing eye makeup do not go hand in hand. Maybe one day I will tackle it. When I am sailing, I will have no choice because no one can just pull over a boat. And even when you're pulled over in a boat, it's still not still, always moving. I I do have an eyebrow pencil, but when I use this, when I do my eyes like this, sometimes I'll take just my leftover eye powder and just kind of fill in my brows just a touch because this color matches pretty good. And maybe it's because I'm a 90s kid, but I'm not really into like the really like dark defined eyebrows and I know that that's pretty much does not make sense to any of this younger generation because they're just like all about major thicker outlined eyebrows but I mean I came from the generation where we had really thin over waxed pencil thin eyebrows so it's just a little bit of an adjustment so I should probably hurry up and do my other eyes before because everybody's waiting on me and everybody's hungry. I'm gonna try this today. This is my eyebrow pencil. So cute. See, it's really creamy. It's kind of coppery. I love coppers. I said eyebrow. Or I meant eyeshadow, not eyebrow. But I love coppers. I love reds. Anything that, not red red, but like orangey red. That's my, that's my jam. I got my eyeshadow done. I just gotta do my mascara. All done with the eyes. Now on to the lips. Very simple lip liner. It pretty much matches my lip color. I think it just makes my lips more defined and a little bit bigger looking. And then I like to use just this, it's a lip plumping lip gloss. Sometimes it's like pretty reddish colored, so I'll just put in a little something to kind of mauve it out. That's it, that's it, that's the way it's gonna look today.